Hello, I'm Rick Murphy, Mayor of Algona, and welcome to my October mayoral update. You know, I thought today would be a good day to herkle durkle, but I knew if I did, I would miss updating you on the latest happenings in Algona. Yes, I did say herkle durkle. If you know what that means, please give me a call. Today, I begin with a few reminders for the month of October. Fire Prevention Week is observed October 6th through the 12th. Members of the Algona Fire Department will visit local schools to perform fire drills during the week. Operation EDITH, which stands for Exit Drills in the Home, began at 6 p.m. on Thursday, October 10th. The Fire Department encourages all households to practice their emergency plans at home and determine what they would do in case of a fire, tornado, or other emergency. And speaking of fire prevention, just a reminder that the City of Algona does not allow open burning of leaves, branches, grass, and other yard waste. All this yard waste may be dropped off at the brush dump site located at Veterans Park. Also, raking leaves and other foliage and grasses onto city streets is a violation as well. As fall and winter approach, please be mindful of cemetery decoration regulations at our two city cemeteries. East Lawn and Riverview. Regulations are posted at the entrance of both cemeteries. The City of Algona is once again permitting trick-or-treating on Thursday, October 31st from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. Thank you parents for teaching your kids about safety that night and thank you drivers for being extra cautious that evening on your way home from work or while transporting your kids to go trick-or-treating. The City of Algona Fall Newsletter is now available on the City website in both English and Spanish. It has been delivered to every household with an Algona address. The newsletter is filled with information concerning Welcome Center updates, the new reconstruction project of the Nebraska Street City parking lot, public library events, our new wastewater treatment plant, the activities associated with our Parks and Rec Department, and so much more. As we close the October update from the mayor, just a reminder to drive carefully and be extra cautious around school zones and crosswalks in general. Well, this concludes my update for this month. Please be sure to join me next month for more news and information. Together we can, together we will, and together we are creating an amazing community now and for the future.